Tonight, police are now calling a fatal car crash a homicide. 33-year-old Ashley Kalo of West Bend died Tuesday. And tonight, another woman is under arrest in connection with her death. 12 News' Nick Bohr reports from Fond du Lac, where the cause of death still remains a mystery. Bystanders described a chaotic scene Tuesday just north of downtown Fond du Lac. We saw the car outside um, up on its wheels and we saw someone take off running. Derek Huckstra heard the crash and found 33-year-old Ashley Kalo of West Bend still inside. We realized the car was still running, so we went to go turn it off and we realized she was still in the car and then um, we didn't know what was wrong at all. She was just kind of unconscious at the point. Derek described her as behind the wheel, slumped over into the other seat. Derek says the car was up on the bushes here. He tried to help Ashley, seeing her in the passenger seat, and she was unresponsive. He says that's when his attention turned to her child in the back seat. So I tried to see if I could wake her up at all, and then it was probably within 10, 15 seconds of yours that uh, there was a kid in the back seat. So. Um, I ran to the other side of the car, got the kid out of the car seat. Derek's mom, Dawn, stepped in. Neither said they saw blood or any indication of what happened to her. She was not conscious. Um, did check for a pulse. At that point, we didn't have one. Rescuers were unable to revive her. Thursday, police announced they'd arrested 20-year-old Annika Trudell of Fond du Lac, suspected of reckless homicide, but have yet to reveal Ashley's cause of death. Ashley's family released a statement reading in part, quote, all you need to know is she was a very loving, awesome woman. She loved her son very much. She is very missed. I just wish we would, there was something else we could have done. I wish I could have done more. I, I really do. I feel bad for that child that broke my heart, knowing that he won't have his mom. You know, like I said, I just I wish I could have done more. In Fond du Lac, Nick Borg, WISN 12 News. Trudell remains in custody on an unrelated drug charge. The district attorney tells 12 News they're still awaiting the reports on the death investigation and no charges have been issued yet.